JD from New York is in a Twitter battle with what seems to be the entire AEW women's locker room. It all started when JD responded to the official AEW account, advertising Jade Cargill's upcoming match against Marina Shafir. In a total of seven words, he expressed his clear lack of excitement for this match. Jade Cargill then quote tweeted him and basically insulted him and called him a mark. JD was unimpressed and asserted that he had no issues with Jade Cargill. He was, however, not a fan of Marina Shafir. He was distraught that Cargill had called him out because he's been a vocal supporter of hers in the past. JD also points out that many seem to agree with his sentiments, citing the like ratio on his original tweet. Cargill responded again, obliging JD's request for better insults. She also reminded him that she's protective of her co-workers, and his attitude towards Marina is what triggered her. JD then tells her that it's his right as a fan to have an opinion, and sharing it has afforded him the level of success he has now. He expresses confusion at the level of blowback he received for his original comments. Other members of the AEW women's locker room wasted no time sounding off on JD. Britt Baker chimed in, taking a dig at JD's status as a wrestling journalist. Nyla Rose responded to Jade Cargill as well, encouraging her to step away from the feud and focus on a potential spa day. Rebel tweeted in response to the controversy, admonishing JD for alleged slander, libel, and insults directed at the women and men of AEW. As things currently stand, the dust is far from settled, and JD's got some serious heat with the AEW TBS champion.